Prince Michael of Greece and Denmark, the cousin of the Duke of Edinburgh and the great-uncle of Queen Sophia, passed away over the weekend at the age of 85 in an Athens hospital, where he is set to be laid to rest. Prince Michael held a unique position as the last surviving grandson of King George I of Greece through his maternal lineage and also boasted ancestry from the House of Bourbon. Before we proceed, please like this video and subscribe to our channel. Despite his royal connections, Prince Michael made a significant choice in 1965 by relinquishing his inheritance rights to marry Marie Nicaela, a talented painter and sculptor, taking on the name Michel de Greece as he pursued a distinguished career as a historian. Together, they raised two daughters, Princess Olga of Greece and Princess Alexandra of Greece. Born in Rome in 1939, Prince Michael was the only son of Prince Christopher of Greece and his second wife, Princess Francisca of Orleans. Tragically, his father passed away when he was just a year old, and his mother died in 1953, leaving him orphaned at the tender age of 14. He found refuge under the care of his uncle Henry of Orleans, Count of Paris, during his formative years. Throughout World War II, Prince Michael resided in various locations such as Morocco, Malaga in Spain, and Paris, before returning to Greece, where he became a pillar of support for the Greek royal family particularly Prince Paul, Queen Frederica, and their three children. Having participated in a youth cruise organized by Queen Frederica in 1954 to unite young European royal heirs, Prince Michael later pursued studies in political science in Paris and served in the Greek Coast Guard during his military tenure. Notably, he was the sole member of the Greek royal family who remained in Greece during the 1967 coup, which led to King Constantine, his nephew, being compelled to depart the country with his family. Prince Michael's decision to marry Marina Kaila, a commoner and renowned artist, in 1965 signified a turning point in his life, as he relinquished his claim to the Greek throne out of love for her. Their enchanting love story captivated the nation, with Michael emphasizing that this choice granted him a newfound sense of autonomy and liberation. Their union was celebrated in a grand ceremony at the Royal Palace in Athens, attended by esteemed guests from both the Greek royal family and the Parisian aristocracy. Following their time in New York and Paris, the couple eventually settled on the picturesque island of Patmos in Greece. Prince Michael delved into a prolific career as a respected novelist, biographer, and historian focusing on ancient Greece, the Ottoman Empire, and European royal lineages. His passion for photography and extensive travels enriched his works, which often paid homage to his royal ancestors. In a reflective interview, Prince Michael pondered the essence of royalty, expressing a belief that while it imbues individuals with a sense of uniqueness, it also renders them akin to everyone else. He regarded royalty as a historical relic, emphasizing his preference for a life of personal choice and freedom. 